up guys and welcome back to another episode of HF Movie Productions and in today's episode I head out to London to do a bit of CEX Blu-ray hunting. Now let's roll the footage and find out what Blu-rays I pick up. Now even if you don't live in the UK, I'm sure you can recognise where we're at now. Yes, we're at the very, very famous UK landmark, Buckingham Palace. Now coming across more famous UK landmarks, we have Big Ben and of course the London Eye. Here we are now in the London Eye and as you can see we have a pretty fantastic view of Big Ben down there and pretty much the whole of London. Now at another very recognisable London landmark, yes, up ahead is Tower Bridge. Here we are, CX. Now, I've never been to the CX before, so hopefully they have some good stuff. Hopefully a whole load of Blue Rays and DVDs. I'm seeing a whole load of video games and I've just walked in. So, hopefully I won't be leaving this CX empty-handed. Just thought, as there is so much video games, might as well show off some. Here's some Xbox One games here. Nothing I'm really interested in though, just thought, I just show them off since they do have a whole bunch of video games. Yeah, nothing really here that I'm interested in. There's some Star Wars Battlefront there, and uh, yeah, Star Wars Squadron Battlefront 2, and some Sniper Elite 4. Yeah, just thought I'd show those off. Now, also coming across some Nintendo DS games. A whole bunch in that section there. PS3 games over here as well. They've got the Indiana Jones game there. Five pounds for that. Now, let's dive in to the Blu-rays. And boy, do they have a lot. Now, let's dive in. Over here, we have Amman and the Wasp Quantumania there for £10 on Blu-ray. Pretty good deal. I haven't seen the movie yet though, so got to get around to watching that at some point. They have 300 there, pretty cool. 22 Jump Street, there, cover reprinted. Avatar, £2. Back to the Future, the trilogy there, for £10. And Bruce Lee, the Master Collection there as well. We also have Batman's not included. Haven't seen that movie, but I've heard it's very, very good. Leave comments down below. Is it any good or not? Now, they also have Bruno here on Blu-ray. Now, I haven't seen this movie, but for 50p, that's a pretty good deal. So, might come back, yeah. 50p, that, that is a good deal. You know what? Why not? 50p for a Blu-ray. Haven't seen this movie yet. Bruno, leave comments down below. Any good, but 50p. I'm picking it up for my collection, and I'll give it a watch as well. So, yeah. Awesome find right here for the collection. Now, yeah. 50p, why not? They also have Chucky there. But I believe that's uh, not the film, but the uh, series. Let's have Deadpool 2 there. Um, it has, is this an Arrow release? I'm not sure. No, I don't think it is. Looks like um, an Arrow release. So there you go. But Deadpool there, don't break. Not sure. Uh, yeah. Emma. Fury 7, uh, yeah, Firestarter, honestly, I thought they'd have a bit more Blu-rays, um, it did look like they had a lot, but now they're just sort of like, face, they're just facing forward, so it makes it look like they have more, and they don't actually have that much, but there you go, just showing off some Xbox 360 games here, 
Yeah, I do have an Xbox 360, but don't really use it that much. So don't really need any of the games there. They have some Harry Potter sets. So 18, the Explosive Extended Edition for 50p. All right, I have the A-Team on DVD, and it is a fantastic movie, so why not upgrade to Blu-ray for 50p, and it's the two-disc Explosive Extended Edition. Why not? Awesome find right here for the collection to upgrade from DVD to Blu-ray. Awesome find right there. Two finds so far, total one pound there. Now let's see what else I can find. They have Jurassic World there. Pop those up there. Yeah, Jurassic World down there, Iron Man 2, Jurassic World Dominion, Jurassic World 3, John Wick 3, Junior, Arnold Schwarzenegger there, £5 for that. Uh, yeah, they also have some Lord of the Rings box sets down here as well. HD DVD down here, uh, March of the Penguins. 50p for that. I don't know, leave comments down below. The Mummy, fantastic movie that on Blu-ray for £2. Megan, the Unseen Edition for £12. No slip, but yeah, it's alright. Don't really need a slip. Uh, yeah, £12, pretty good deal for that movie. It is a good movie, I've seen it. If you haven't seen it, it's worth a watch if you like um, horror movies, yeah. They also have a three movie set here for £12. Yeah. I mean, not much I could say. Um, some Frankenstein. Some Harry Potter. The cover reprinted for 350. Harry Potter. Again, not really my cup of tea, Harry Potter, but I do have all the films on DVD. You also have to scream for here. Five pounds on Blu-ray. Now my local CX was selling the DVD for five pounds, so that shows the price differences in CX. But there you go. Have it on DVD, picked it up for 99p on DVD in a charity shop, so don't really need to upgrade. Let's have Saw, really cool, one pound for that. Robin Hood, more Robin Hood up there. Spider-Man, No Way Home, Twins, Top Gun, uh, Thor. Yeah, some decent stuff, but nothing I really need. Uncharted there, fantastic film, £6 for that, Wonder Woman, yeah. These two so far, the A-Team and Bruno over here, this looks like the kids stuff, but yeah. Oh, they have some Clone Wars down there, that's pretty cool. Uh, the Lego Movie, Cinderella, live action version. And yeah, some Clone Wars. Yeah, they do have the Clone Wars right here. £2.50. I really enjoyed this movie. I know some people didn't, but I really enjoyed it. And I have it on DVD. And I enjoyed it a lot. So, I mean, why not? £2.50. It's not that much money. So why not upgrade to Blu-ray? I really enjoyed this movie. So why not? £2.50. A very good deal for this. Yeah. There we go. Right, if you've seen that movie, leave a comment down below. What are your thoughts on that film? Some more Clone Wars there as well for £12. We also have Puss in Boots to the Last Wish. Still haven't seen that. Need to get around to watching that as well. Uh, and some anime down there as well. Yeah, not much else. I think that's probably going to do it for upstairs anyway because they do have it downstairs. Hold on a second. I missed this section over here. They have some 4Ks over here as well. They have Black Adam, Bullet Train, The Batman, The Evil Dead... You know, stuff like that. Batman Begins down there as well. Yeah, some good prices. Uh, six pound there, yeah. I mean, there's not many 4Ks, but there's some. So, might as well show them off. And a couple of Blu-rays here as well. But, uh, yeah. I think that's going to do it. Just three, mo just three movies right here. We have The Clone Wars for £2.50. The A-Team for 50p, which I am dropping on the floor. And now I'm picking it up, literally, I am picking it up. So yeah, and Bruno as well for 50p. Awesome finds right here. Now, going downstairs, this is supposed to be where all their DVDs are. Now, I'm already seeing some, some DVDs, one pound DVDs there. Yeah, they, they have a lot. 
I'm going to be here for a while, trust me. Now, they have PlayStation 2 games as well. I do have a PlayStation 2. So, just quickly go through these. Yeah. You can get that cheaper at car boot or somewhere like that. Uh, yeah. I'm really interested in the PlayStation 2 games at CX because of their prices. They're about two to three pounds each. So, yeah, probably passing on those. However, the DVDs... I will not be passing on. Let's have a look at what they have. They have some box sets. I believe this is the TV section. Yeah, TV and documentary. Now, Dexter TV show. Yeah. Now, the movies. One pound DVDs over here. They have Ted, Spider-Man, Taken. I'm seeing a whole bunch of stuff. Let's dive in. Scorpion King there. Haven't seen that yet. Need to get around to watching that. Have it on DVD already, so don't need it. But this is a two disc special issue. Mm. Haven't seen it. I'm going to pass on it. Already have it on DVD, so it won't be needing that. I need to watch it though at some point. They have another copy of it there. They have The Sum of All Fears, Shooter with Mark Wahlberg in. Uh, yeah, Ted, as I said before. Uh, yeah. Just sort of skimming over because I don't want to be in here for too long. Yeah, Slumdog Millionaire. What's this? Source code. Leave comments down below. Any good? I also have Superman Returns there as well. Hot Fuzz. Yeah. Robocop. Fantastic film. Uh, Pirates of the Caribbean. Some Rocky here. Yeah. Invasion. £2.50. £2.50, hang on. Well, that's in the wrong section, isn't it? £1 DVD. Oh, I'll just leave that there. They also have Ride Along there on DVD. Yeah. Mamma Mia. Mamma Mia. Most Haunted. Series 5. Never heard of that show. Leave comments down below. Any good? Probably not. Uh, Tom Cruise in Minority Report there. Yeah, just sort of skimming through since there is so many DVDs. It's going to take a while to go through them all. Uh, Mission Impossible 2. Nico. Some Mr. Deeds. Adam Sandler there. Night at the Museum. That's a good film. Night at the Museum 2 as well. That's a good film as well. Not as good as the first one, but still a good film. Phone Booth. Missions 11. Pitch Perfect 2. Baby Driver. Yeah. Just skimming over. See what there is. Yep. Looks like mostly common titles in this section. Limitless there. Around the other side, we come across more DVDs. We have the Hulk there, the uh, 2003 Hulk, not the um, the newer version. Can't remember what year that came out, but there you go. Friends have the complete um, series box set, so don't need those. Ghost, Ghost Rider, The Godfather. G.I. Joe, Rise of the Cobra. The Bourne films. They're fantastic films. If you haven't seen them, definitely worth a watch. They have Matt Damon in. Well, all, all the way up to um, The Bourne Legacy. They also have Daywatch here on Steelbook DVD. The director's cut for £1. There, never seen this movie before. If you have, leave a comment down below. Any good? I'm thinking maybe, maybe it could be a good, a good film. Coach Carter there as well. That's a fantastic film. Uh, yeah. We also have the, the expand. What am I saying? The Expandables there. Final Destination 2. Final Destination 3. And Fight Club. There, for one pound. Yeah. Final Destination, the original. It was an okay movie. Nothing really too good. But yeah, I enjoyed it. Thought it was good. That's about it. Uh, yeah. 
We also have some James Bonds over here. Quantum of Silence. Die Another Day. Scene of Royale. Two guns. Again, um, Mark Wahlberg. 21 Jump Street. 300. Uh, blended. Adam Sandler. 4321. Alien vs. Predator. 2. One pound there. The Amazing Spider Man 2. Good film. Alien 3. A good film as well. They don't really come across the single DVD that often. Yeah, the. Uh, not gonna say that because might get, might get um, get showered out by YouTube there. But there you go. Oh, there we go. Well, anyway, they have Apex here as well. Kind of looks like an alien ripoff, but leave comments down below. I don't know. I haven't seen it. Yeah. Speed Bang Theory, babies. Okay. If you've seen that, leave a comment down below. But yeah. Basic. Um, what's that? Crank down there as well. Clarkson Thriller. That was good. So one pound for that. Also, Clarkson Supercar Showdown. Yeah, that was good as well. I do like the Jamie Clarkson sort of documentary things. They're, they're good. If you haven't seen them, I do suggest that you watch them. Uh, Vin Diesel, Chronicles of Riddick, here for £1. And, uh, yeah, Cloverfield. Mostly common stuff, honestly. I'm not really seeing anything that's jumping out at me. So, yeah. yeah. This is the horror, I believe. Maybe. They have Alien. Oh, the Alien, the director's cut. Now, this is the one you need to watch this has some added scenes so yeah well worth watching director's cut before you watch the, the the other cut of it basically uh yeah they have the Arnold Schwarzenegger set here I have this exact set in my collection so won't be needing that for £1.50 though for all those films that are in there very very good deal just have 1917 there on DVD for £3 and uh, Avengers Assemble, Batman Begins, Bumblebee, good film, Creed, Captain America Civil War, good film as well, um, yeah, The Boogie £12 for the DVD, uh, they, they just released a new one didn't they, um, 2023's The Boogie Man, I believe it has the directors from Stranger Things behind the film, could be wrong about that, but I believe so. Leave comments down below. Battleship there on DVD as well. I think that's probably going to do it. Yeah. No DVDs. All just Blu-rays today, but that's pretty much what I was going coming in here for. Just a couple of Blu-rays for the collection. Not a massive haul, but it's a haul at least. Fast and Furious set there as well. That's pretty cool. Anyway. I think that's probably good. They have some Elvis DVD sets there as well. Yeah. Harry Potter. Halloween collection there as well. Hook. That's a good film. Uh, Godzilla. Good film. Yeah. Grown Ups 2. I know you probably... Most people disagree with this comment, but... Grown Ups 2. Good film. Good fellas there. One pound fifty. Fast and Furious Six, good film. Mm. Sing, it was all right. Uh, yeah, I think that's probably gonna do it. I know I've said that like two times before, but I just keep seeing stuff that you know piques my interest. Um, Home Alone there for one pound fifty. Harry Potter. They have a lot of Harry Potter DVD sets here. Iron Man, Independence Day, Hellboy, The Hobbit, Hugo. Yeah. What else do they have over here? The Miserables. And some Jurassic World Dominion. 
Longest Day, Logan, yeah, a couple of duplicates in this section here. Knock at the Cabin, fantastic film. Also, Lock, Stock and Two, and Two Smoking Barrels, yeah. Get my words mixed up, the director's cut here on the DVD. I do have this in my collection, but it's not the director's cut, but it is the two disc special edition. There you go. And it's not that sort of release either. But yeah. Uh, Lock, Stock and Two Smoking Barrels is a fantastic film if you haven't seen it. If you have seen it, and you haven't seen Snatch, go watch Snatch. The Snatch is amazing notes as well. Yeah, I think that's probably going to do it for the third time. But yeah, I'm, I'm seeing stuff that piques my interest. The Meg there, um, the new ones in cinemas at the moment, the Meg 2. Some steel books here. Olympus Has Fallen, fantastic film. Yeah. Not seeing much else. It. Rush Hour. Red. Good film. Um, not seeing much else. Honestly. Honestly. Um, Sin City. Still book here. £1.50. Collector's Edition. Haven't seen that film. Leave comments down below. But yeah. I, I am seeing good stuff. So it's not that I'm seeing nothing that I want to pick up. But I am seeing good stuff. But it's stuff I already own. Or... The price is, is a bit too high. Robocop the trilogy there, three fifty. Sherlock Holmes, Star Wars trilogy box set there for six pounds. That's a pretty good deal if you didn't already have all the movies like I do. So yeah, I'm gonna be needing that. Megan DVD there and Smile DVD. How many three up there? The Vault. Again, unpopular opinion, but I enjoyed Terminator 3. Venom. The Chronicles of... Wait, no, no, no. Vin Diesel 3 movie franchise. Pitch Black, Triple X, and Fast and Furious. Yeah, two good movies in there that I know of anyway. Uh, Fast and Furious and Triple X. I have seen. Pitch Black, however, I have not. So, yeah, got to get around to watching that. Uh, yeah, I think that's probably going to do it. I'm not seeing much else. Some empty shelves there. I need to fill in those. Yeah, just going to be Star Wars The Clone Wars here on Blu-ray for £2.50. The 18 there for 50p on Blu-ray. And Bruno for 50p on Blu-ray. Awesome finds right here for the collection. Definitely going to be heading out to the CX. A lot more awesome finds. All right, let's have a look at what I picked up. So up first, I picked up the A-Team here on Blu-ray for 50p. I just had to pick this up. It's the Explosive Extended Edition with two discs in there. As you can see, this truly is an awesome find right here for the collection to replace my DVD copy. So I don't need the DVD anymore. I can now just have the Blu-ray for 50p. I just had to pick this up. How could I pass on this? The Explosive Extended Edition with two discs. For 50p. And yeah, it's the A-Team. The A-Team is amazing. And it's a fantastic film. If you haven't seen it, definitely go watch it. It is a great film. So I also picked up Star Wars The Clone Wars here for £2.50. This truly is an awesome find right here for the collection. And it truly is a fantastic film. Again, I picked this up to upgrade and to replace my DVD copy. So I won't be needing that anymore. This truly is an awesome find right here. For the collection, as you can see, one disc in there, but that's fine because it Star Wars The Clone Wars and it's a fantastic movie to have in high definition. And if you haven't seen Star Wars The Clone Wars, definitely go watch it because it's a fantastic film as well. For £2.50, just had to pick this up on Blu-ray. Okay, now moving on to the final title that I picked up. This is Bruno here on Blu-ray. Now, I haven't seen this movie before. If you have, leave a comment down below. But I thought for 50p, oh, there's the receipt. I might as well pick this up. For 50p, I mean, you can't really go wrong. 50p for a Blu-ray, Bruno. Never seen it before, leave comments down below. Looks like a good movie though. So there you go, that's all I picked up in today's episode. Three titles, three Blu-rays, and the receipt. So there you go, if you have enjoyed it, make sure you hit that like button and that subscribe button. Check down below for all the different links such as Letterbox and Vinted, and I'll see you guys in the next episode. Thanks for watching, goodbye. Thank you.